lesson I'm going to be showing you how to create scenes in Adobe Animate. Uh, using scenes in Adobe Animate is very useful and it helps you to organise your movie so that you don't get a, a very long timeline. Uh, so I'm going to create a very simple animation, just a very simple one, just to show you how to use scenes. Uh, so I'm, I'm going to create a, um, a shape. So let's go to the alpha and we have our shape here and I think I'll just do a very simple shape tween. Uh, so I'll place my um, rectangle on this side and I'll right click choose uh, insert keyframe, hold down the shift key and I'll move this along so it goes off the timeline and in the middle I'll create a uh, create a shape tween. So we have our animation there and we can create a, a new scene to follow on from this animation instead of carry, carrying on uh, along this timeline. So if I go to window uh, scene it's going to bring up this dialog box and this dialog box is the scene panel. So as you can see we have a scene already so by default this is scene one. Uh, to add a new scene I need to click on this icon here. Uh, I don't know if you can see it's quite small and if I click on that plus sign it will create a totally brand new scene and as you can see uh, on that panel I have a second scene which is called scene two. So uh, I'm going to create a, another shape. Uh, so with the oval tool I'm going to hold down the shift key and do exactly the same thing really. I'm going to just create a very simple shape tween just to show you um, how useful it is uh, to have scenes. Uh, so I'm going to put a, a keyframe in the timeline. So I'm going to control click choose insert keyframe. So in this keyframe I'll have this, uh, I'll just move this along here and in this keyframe I'll move it along there and then in the middle I'll do a shape, uh, shape tween and I might actually uh, just label this uh, scene uh, two so that you're, we're really aware that, that this is scene two. So if I just type scene two. Uh, so I'll just put that there. Uh, just copy this. And I don't know if you've noticed, but there's a drop down menu there and that will allow us to see all the scenes in this movie. So I'm going to go back to scene one and create a new layer and um, I'll just put the title in there. Uh, so this will be, um, sorry about that, this will be scene one. So I'll just place that there. Um, let's just place it there, I think it was round about there. So if we go to scene two, uh, and then you can see we've got scene one and, and scene two. Uh, so let's create a further a further scene. So again, just as a reminder, you click on this plus sign here that says add scene. Um, but the other thing we can do, we can uh, copy scenes. So I can select uh, scene two and go to this icon here that says duplicate. So I can duplicate the scene. And as you can see there, if I go down to my drop down menu, you can see that we've got scene one and uh, scene two and we've got a copy of uh, scene two and we can just gently uh, click in here or right click in here and choose rename or double click so I'm going to call this scene three uh, so I'm just going to make sure it's all lined up and everything so this is our third scene um, so this is scene three I'm going to just change this to scene at three and I'm going to select this um, all of this timeline here and right click and um, actually want to reverse these frames just going to make sure that everything is selected and then 
choose reverse frame just so that it's a bit different. Um, so if we go back to scene one, you can see we've got scene one, scene two, scene three. And this is also represented um, in this dialog box here. And if you're not happy with the scene, you can always select it and then click on the delete scene just there. Uh, so if I go to control, uh, test movie, Adobe Animate, we've got scene one, scene two, and scene three. Scene one, two, and three. I hope that was useful for you.